Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Heart Gold. I'm your host, the Pokegamer. In the last episode, we had explored through 25, we battled the Nugget Trainers or whatever, um, and now we're on Route 9, trying to get to the power plant so we can, you know, do all that other happy, you know, bullshit. Um, so we'll be continuing to do so today, and a couple of the trainers that we're about to be fighting are, you know, rock trainers, so could you please talk to this guy, please? Thank you. Instead of running all the way around him like five times. This guy has three golems, all I think level 42. I can't remember if the first one was 42 or not. And it is. I'll just go with the surf. I'm not sure if you can hear the fan directly behind me, so I'm kind of, you know, sorry if you can hear it, it's just way too hot here right now. And like my headphones that I'm using to record, um, you know, the fucking fiber, like fabric or whatever that they put over the earphones, yeah, that kind of doesn't help. Like, it's kind of like having earmuffs in summer. It's, you know, I want to kind of get one of those stand mics to use, but that requires money, so. And then the guy that we're going to face directly after this has an onyx, and I can't remember what the other one was. Oh, a duck trio, that was what it was. I just remember now. Okay, now we go over here, we go down, we go down again, and we talk to this guy. Really? Fine, I don't care. That's a big a deal for me. Duck Trio is going to outspeed as well. And for Earthquake or Magnitude, or Earth Power. story. And then goes the trio. And Quacks are leveled up. Damn, I actually feel, you know, a beat of sweat. That's kind of bad. I don't even remember if I picked this up before. And by that I mean I had to re-record, because, you know... So now we go down here, we do not talk to her just yet, because I need to change up my lead. Unless I want to be four times weak to both of her Pokémon. Typhlosion, please. I guess I could've just gone with what's-his-name, but, you know... She has two Skiplings, I think they're both level 43. Also, like I said, I'm recording this for the second time because I needed to, you know, do a few things and I was interrupted and so on and so forth. Uh, the first time I did this, I used the Typhlosion against the trainer with the three golems and the eruption killed all three in one shot. Um, choice specs, full HP, Typhlosion is kind of nasty. So. Here in my chair. Ooh -hoo. Oh boy, unnecessary crit. And then she is the last trainer, so what I'm going to do is if I have any repels left, I'm going to be using said repel. Which I don't think I have any. Yeah, I have none, apparently. So, all the random encounters that we will now be dealing with. Oh, look, I didn't get one this time. Last time I got one the first step into the grass. How much would have been I'm going to get it the next time I step into the grass? I 
Don't know if I really need to heal, but I'm going to anyways. I mean, why the hell not? And there's people that we have to talk to in here anyways, so... Yeah. There's that. Talk to this chick. Which, by the way, she tells me something I already know. Two steps into the grass, that was better than last time. I also did not know you could find level 15 primates in this area. Fun fact. Yeah, only one encounter that time. By the way, that item up there, I don't know what it is, but I don't have cut on me. I don't intend on going and getting a cutter just to check an item. I ran into at least five goldines here, so let's see how many I find this time. Here's number two. You know how pissed off I would be if I ended up finding a shiny goldine? Number three. Number four. Yep. <sighs> See, I wouldn't mind a shiny Voltorb, but I'm not sure when it actually learns self-destruct or explosion. I know it gets one, I think, at a whole early level. All the random encounters. Yay! No more for now. Here, walk into the wall. Like a good Ethan, just walk into that wall. You like the taste of wall, don't you? Sorry, but it's extremely annoying whenever, you know... He speaks of charge beam, this is an, a TM that we'll be getting, and then if you have a Doug Trio, you can trade it for a Magneton right there. And... Sure, why not? Police can't do this shit themselves, so whatever. Let's walk into the wall twice before, like, the wall directly next to the door, too. Like, are you that fucking retarded? Cerulean, please. Now, again, in case of glitches, we will save, because, you know, 18 random encounters on top of flying usually equals, you know, glitch, which we do not want. Someone shoot me now, please. Like, this heat is absolutely ridiculous. I'm hoping that the rain just reduces the temperature, j even just slightly. Hello, Team Rocket. How are you? Didn't get enough from Johto? You know, you would think that, you know, after getting your asses handed to you and disbanding not once but twice, you know, you'd learn. Now, this is something I fucked up in the last time I tried to record. This is part of the reason why I actually, re you know, restarted my recording. It was because I wasn't, like, I had forgotten what all I needed to do immediately after this. And, yeah, great. Yeah, hiding in plain sight with your Team Rocket outfit on. Are you retarded? Hmm. 
And he has a level 43 gold bat? No, a level 39, okay. Somewhere around 40, that's all, all I know. GG, please. That was probably over 200% damage. I say that because I kind of watch him play on Showdown. I believe in both, uh, well not both, but gold, silver, crystal, you didn't even have to bother talking to this guy. You could just get the part immediately, but in this game you have to talk to him, battle him. Thank you, mister, for walking right in my path like a dick. But yeah, when I tried to record this the first time, I was searching for the part because I had forgotten like everything that I needed to do. If I remember correctly, the part's right here. Yep. And if I'm not mistaken, I can fly out to that Pokemon Center. But 18,000 random encounters says we need to go get repels. Just saying. As far as I don't have any repels. By 99. Go with 50. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I can fly out to that Pokemon Center. Let's go ahead and see if we can or not. No, we cannot. Go figure. So, well, hi ho, hi ho, away we go. Mistaken, I just go into all these walls and then we're done, you know. <sighs> you know what? Instead of shooting me, shoot Ethan, please. Wow, you actually went, you know, a little ways without having to deal with, you know. Okay. Yes, we won our Poke Gear. You can tell that I'm getting very annoyed. <sighs> We're not giving fucks about random encounters. I don't have to really talk to anyone now. Except for him. And like I said before, we will be getting Charge Beam. Which is a really good move, by the way. I don't know if he said anything. I mean, I guess he's only slightly different. Now then, we need to fly here. I don't know if I have enough time to do this part. We might. It's only like a minute. And it's not like we have trainer fights anymore, considering we already did them. Thank you, cars outside, for going vroom, 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 vroom. Gotta hate the bike music so much, that's why I was trying to not bump into everything. Then again, this bike's music's not as bad as the fucking black and white ones. Come on, we got like a minute. Yay! Ethan Man walks into every wall. Stupid jackass. There we go, we can trigger this. And now Missy's boyfriend runs off. I think this music's actually very appropriate. But now we can go to the gym, and then in the next episode we can, you know, why am I going this way when I can just, you know, go around? Trying to get back to, you know, Cerulean so I can kind of be right at the gym whenever we start the next episode. So, we and he was in my way, but now he's not. 
So, in the next episode, we will be taking on the Cerulean Gym, and most likely taking on Misty as well, because, I mean, this gym doesn't have very many trainers in it, so it should be kind of a, you know, walk in the park. So, yeah, stay tuned for that in the next episode. So, until next time, this is Team, or, yeah, Team, the Pokegamer, signing out.